the COVID catch-up is filmed live in front of no one because, you know, isolation. Hey, uh, welcome to the COVID catch-up and a little shout-out to our technical support brought to you by DolphinSmooth.com. A uh, big thanks to them folks at DolphinSmooth.com. And again, actually we have that title sponsor uh, back again, Serapis Toilet Tissues. Uh, make toilet time an enjoyable time with the comfort of Serapis Toilet Tissues because there taint nothing wrong with having a comfortable bathroom break. So thanks again to Sarah Pease. Uh Week three, here we are, or uh, whatever week you are. Have you lost count? It's just week whatever now. And really, I think at this point, you could just start unplugging the clocks around the house because it doesn't really matter anymore, does it? It's breakfast for dinner. It's watching movies at 8 a.m., wine anytime, PJs anytime. Yeah, just, just unplug the clocks. It's a lot easier if you do that. And how's the old COVID-20 going? I know uh, some folks always talk about the freshman 15 when you're in school, but uh, packing on the pounds yet? <clears throat> you can just blame it on the virus. You'll find something to blame it on, won't you? Yeah. Uh, myself, yes, it is week three. Uh, a few updates uh, on my end. Some isolation facts that you might want to consider. <clears throat> uh, played Monopoly with myself, and someone still flipped the board. Because that just happens. I think it's something built into that game. Uh, and have a, a toddler here, which you get to play a lot of a lot of fun games with the toddler, keeping them busy uh, during all this. But uh, you'll quickly discover if it's anything to do with building blocks or creating anything. Uh, it, it very quickly turns into an episode of Fraggle Rock, where you are the doozer. You're creating something. You're constantly building. And at any time, the toddler becomes the Fraggle that wants to destroy it and just uh, crush it and, and keep going. Basically, you do that, and you just repeat for hours and hours, and, and that's what it is. And it's fun. It's good. Uh, as for my uh, routine come week three, uh, one of the things I try to do, uh, I try to catch the Prime Minister's daily updates, but I'll be honest, um, and I'm probably not the only person to mention this, I don't really go for that. It's the, the, the sign language people that I like to watch. Have you, have you caught any of this? It is uh, amazing. Uh, a, well, just that they're signing and getting the message across, but the, the faces these people make are incredible, and it, it makes me think I really need somebody to do some sign language for the COVID uh, catch-up here. And actually, you don't even need to sign. I just think it'd be hilarious to have somebody down in the corner just making faces at some of the things that I'm saying. So if you're up for that, uh, let me know. Let me know. A little bit of a, a week three challenge I have for you. Maybe you're starting to get a little bored around the house. Here it is. Uh, what Rocky movie are you presently? So basically, think of all the Rocky movies and then picture what character or what level of Rocky you would currently be. Maybe you're maybe you're still doing good. Maybe you're like Rocky Three in the suits at the press conference, got the hair going, you're looking good. Or maybe you're you're back to the first Rocky and it's just uh, sweat stained jogging pants and you're all disheveled all the time. Uh, whatever it is, I'd like to see a photo, actually. Just send me a, a picture of what uh, what Rocky you are. Maybe it is a Rocky char character. Have you just turned grizzled and angrily, angry like Mickey towards everybody you live with? You just it's, it's been too long together. Maybe that's it. You're just mad about everything. Or, or how's the hair? Maybe you're starting to get a little mullety like uh, Tommy Gunn in Rocky IV. Uh, again, just uh, send me your Rocky photo. What, what Rocky, what Rocky level are you now? with all this isolation. And uh, just another little final one uh, before we get going, uh, a social distancing pro tip. I know last time I had my uh, Nickelback suggestion, which, uh, hey, so far so good here. Hope it's helping you out. Uh, my other one is just, I think we can do almost like a, a Stuart Smalling type of uh, daily COVID-19 affirmation. So find a mirror, look in the mirror, and just do your little daily affirmation. I'm isolated enough, I'm social distancing enough, and gosh darn it, people stay away from me. So uh, that's it. We're going to wrap this up. Uh, again, if you'd like a written transcript of the uh, COVID catch-up, uh, drop me a line because I've got nothing better to do and I can obviously use the human interaction. Uh, by the way, those uh, limited edition COVID-19... Sorry, i got to pull this up again. The, uh, the technical uh, production of this, it doesn't come cheap. So again, uh, thanks to our friends at dolphinsmooth.com. Check out those fine folks dolphinsmooth.com for all the uh, the productions. And again, if you want a t-shirt of the COVID catch-up logo, uh, uh, once again, it's uh, $300. Just send me that and materials and instructions on how to do that. We'll get you one to you. And uh, thanks again to our sponsors, uh, Serapis Toilet Tissues. Couldn't do it without them. Uh, check out dolphinsmooth.com as well as my website, gilmoreshow.com, and you can figure out a way to send me your rocky pictures. So do that. And uh, hey, 
Until next week, be safe. And actually got a special little one for you today if it's going to work again. Production values. Uh, we're going to, a nice little thing the toddler is going to send us out today. Uh, by the way, his Rocky would be, he'd be Dolph Lundgren. He'd be uh, the Russian from Rocky IV because as we were uh, playing Ricks the other day, he, uh, he quite clearly exclaimed, I will break you before he smashed one of the things I was building. So there you go. I, I found out what Rocky level he is, and here he is to take me out. I think this is currently my favorite version of this song. Again, be safe, and we'll catch you next time. Oh, oh Canada, how home and make out.